All right, so what I'm doing is I'm resetting my settings. Basically starting a new stream over because I hit the wrong button. Oops, my bad. Getting it together, y'all. I will be in time for the after show, so don't worry. No worries. Hell, y'all know I ain't fancy. I'm just over here being myself, shit. I spent so many years of my life trying to be fancy for people and shit. It's hard to get a tip. You know what I'm saying? Cause I ain't no kiss ass. Come on, girl. Over time, my hair will start blowing up, but it's like really wet right now. I just got out the shower before I started the stream. We were on for about maybe 48 minutes before I started. So. Come on, come on. And maybe 45 minutes. Some around that time zone. So I'm getting it started again. Here we go. First thing first. I don't need no problems. Age restriction is on. There we go. Everything done. Everything good. You know what? As a matter of fact. Might as well go on over there now. Hold on. Thank you to whoever hit that like button. Oh, shit. Somebody hit that like button already. And I didn't even put up the disclaimer. Let me do this. Yikes. Who that is? Who that? Don't be shy. Say hi. I am here to chat. Please remember that this channel is for adults and adults only. I know I sound drunk. I only had a few sips, too. I should just, like right now but i ain't so let's go it's friday Okay, so let's see. Here we go. Okay, I'm got my party chat going. We good. Let's see. We are in an invite only session. Good to see you, boss. I actually am gonna leave the um, party chat prioritized to party chat until. It's time to go. Let's drive something else. Let's change our clothes. Because I am trying to do that video I was telling y'all about. So, helps me some. Kind of that last shit fucked up. you've got here did I mention okay. that I have an MBA no problem I'll have your personal vehicle brought around
This will be my weekend project to That's not my cat, but it keeps coming over here every day because my cat decided she wanted to share her food with it, so it thinks I'm supposed to feed it. Oh, Lord, I done stopped on my own car. That's okay. Let's try to get one arena game in before we start, at least. I oh, know, don't mind me. I just be doing shit. I know ain't nobody sending nothing to my game phone when y'all can see I'm playing. I'm busy. I never switched teams, but I did that on accident. Can't say that in real life, can you? know what I'm focused on. I don't think I'm going to do it in time. But I'm trying and it's raggedy too. Like I split it all fucked up trying to rush. So did like it's raggedy than a bitch. I just dropped the little weeds. I never do that either. Oh, man.
I love what I do. What did I just do? All right, I think I got some, but I gotta wait. Come on, Harry, wake up. I don't even care who runs over that mine. Another one. Getting into concussion territory there. What are you doing, teammates? All right, let me just go on over this way. Hey, hey, who's that? Don't be shy. Say hi. I'm here to chat. Please remember that this channel is for adults and adults only. If you're not a grown-up, get out. Bye-bye. Sign our deuces. If you are an adult and you happen to like what you see here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so that you don't miss out on all the awesome things that happen at this channel. Don't forget to, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Yeah, we got a perfect explanation for that. This. As I said, this channel is for adults and adults only. If you're not a grown-up, get out. Come on, dumbass teammate. What are you doing? Oh, it's an orange guy. Okay, he fighting for his life. Orange guy whooping our ass. Our team is stupid, first off. Not just because they're the enemy, but because they're over there fucking each other up, and my team is doing the same thing. Right. What, see what I'm saying? Just trying to get somewhere where I could shoot these motherfucking balls in place. Oh, little head on action I think that's what he said. I'm just trying to shoot these balls in place. Sorry. Team 
At least I'm fighting shit. I don't know what this radio station doing either. Where's the hole? I'm trying to play with their ass now. This is just the first round, y'all. So, I think we got just enough time for this before we move into TTL. Oh, 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 oh. This is about to be a Drunk Friday episode. This is hilarious. My hair won't dry. I can only do this if it's wet, y'all. I'm telling y'all, my hair be stiff. Don't move. Puff up like a mug. Winning by one point. Now I'm trying my ass off, but shit. It's the liquor. Damn, I tried to drop a mine first. I'm going after that guy. Fuck him. I'm tired of him. I'm going to actually kill him. Where is he? Come on, dumbass teammate. Get out the way. I'm trying to kill somebody. Looks like an even number of bombs on each side. Right in the pocket. Now, a score by team. 
Come on, team. Teammate, that's what it is. We got teammates going the wrong way. The machine guns are adding some excitement here. What are they doing? Round is round I'm starting to feel like myself. doing idiot that guy's head. Oh, I finally saw him. I thought he left. See? And this is just another round. Yep, I got just enough time to do this before we start the show. And what? It's happening over there, as a matter of fact. I should actually check to see if they watched the last show, huh? Psh. Ain't nobody checking. As much as y'all talk dirty and lust and all that shit, nobody care. But I'm still in a lot of trouble like a lot of people see me as shit. Let's go happen when people start seeing me. Oh shit. Hello Lewis. I had no idea anybody was watching.
Thank you for telling me you're here. Watching from PlayStation and he can't comment. But I know who he is. Somebody I know for a long time. He's come to the club. Okay, y'all. Oh. oh, head on collision. That's gonna leave a mark. And they told me that they couldn't watch at all from the PlayStation because of the age restrictions. So if you're watching me from your PlayStation, then that tells me a lot. They're not trying to enter their birthday or they're not trying to fix something. They got kids, something, I don't know. And uh, I don't have none. I'm just doing me in these streets. I'm just doing me, man. So, I don't know how you doing it if you able to watch me on PlayStation. Maybe your ass lying, I don't know. Twenty minutes for the show to start, y'all. I don't know. This ain't gonna take twenty more minutes. So I guess I'm gonna have to take her and sit her down somewhere. Dumbass teammate. I really was blocking the shit out that motorcycle just now. He was mad. He started shooting me. Up, but not in time. Here's the final round. The orange team is behind. 
I'm kind of cheating a little bit. Yeah. Hit that respawn button. Oh, that's why. They only got two people on their damn team. And I don't care. My hair will not fucking dry, y'all. Just won't dry. There we go. I'm starting to look like me. Puffing. Dry, bitch. Dry. <laughs> Lift, bitch. Do what you do in real life. Don't be trying to act cute in front of the camera. Yeah, I'm talking to my hair. Hold on. I gotta get up out of here. Make a quick run. We got... Ooh, only a few minutes. Okay. Okay, real quick, be right back. I'm dancing on the side. I eat a granola bar.
my controller did not want to do things the right way so we've got exactly 12 minutes and it takes long to get shit set up so here we go okay here we go y'all getting things ready If you knew and you don't know, you're going to hear me shuffling. You're going to hear me moving. you going to hear cameras and things sliding, tables and all kind of shit. Alright, so we are absolutely going back into invite only. priority to game chat so you guys can see her mouth move okay so have things removed <clears throat> yep, I'm opening up a small bag of chips. This loud ass cat must be in heat or something because I don't know what's happening out there, but damn. Getting shit straight. All right, y'all. So I'm going to fix my banner real quick. my computer really be tripping All right, you guys, so I'm going to have my snack in the back while we get the show started. 
hit them with their intros. She's going to stay here. Get her a drink. Uh huh. What the fuck is that? That is not what was supposed to be happening. Yeah, I'm about to trim that shit. That was stupid as hell. Sorry if y'all hear the crunch. support and for being here all the time if anybody is listening in on youtube thank you so much for sticking it in i mean sticking around please remember that's this channel it's friday and i'm drunk please remember that this channel is for adults and adults only if you're not a grown-up get out if you are an adult and you happen to like what you see here go ahead hit that subscribe button so that you don't miss out on all the awesome things that happen at this channel now people on youtube are used to this this is like my favorite soda it really is. I know it's the cheap soda, but it's my favorite. The Shasta Tiki Punch. They're used to seeing me take big gulps of that on stream. It actually gets some of them that's been here for a long time really excited because I don't quite do it as often as I used to. Get my belly. Okay, so. Here we go. My hair is starting to dry, so. Okay. 
Forgive me, y'all. My mic has been muted the whole damn time. I guess because I was playing that video. But yeah, my hair is starting to dry. It's um, going to get fluffy on y'all in a minute. I was saying that this Shasta soda is my favorite drink. People on YouTube are really used to me drinking it. It does get some people excited, happy that have been here for a long time. And see, I stick to the, you know, stick to it. Ain't enough money in here, but I'm going to run through it real quick. That's for them. I'm going to sit her right here so they can get a view. Hey, y'all. Hey. So. Welcome. If anybody is listening on YouTube, please remember. I am queen of this channel, Everything Vulgar, and also your host, Too Persuasive, and that this channel is for adults and adults only. If you're not a grown-up, get out. If you are an adult and you happen to like what you see here, go ahead Hit that subscribe button so that you don't miss out on all the awesome things that happen at this channel. And yes, yeah, sometimes awesome things kind of do happen at this channel. But hey, I ain't in control of that part. I'm just one of the very small awesome parts. Hey, get it. I'm not saying I'm not awesome. Shit, I ain't gonna lie to you like that. Try to make this thing fluff with fluff shit. Okay, I can handle that. It's going to fall until it dries. When it dries, then it's going to be Fro City, and I won't know what to do with it. But right now, it's like, yeah, play with it. Play with me. That's what she said. Okay, so, there we go. I like that. There we go. We're rolling with that today. All right, sorry to you guys that can't see me on camera. I'm really tripping and flipping my hair around and doing stuff. So, now that I can see who's here, nobody's here on OnlyFans. Got one viewer on YouTube. But now I, when I can, now that I can see viewers and things like that, it's cracking. Okay, I'm gonna change her pose. She talking to y'all real quick. Let's get her ready for her close-up. Because, yeah, there it is. She was just kind of far away. Can't really see her mouth moving. And that's the point of sharing the audio here. Doing it the way I like it. All right, y'all. So let's go ahead and start with our first article. It's exactly 8.01. It is now time for Topless Talk Live to actually begin we start at 8 p.m. Pacific, 10 p.m. Central, 11 p.m. Eastern at OnlyFans.com forward slash to Persuasive every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday. Mm-hmm. Now, I'm going to go ahead and find our first article. Okay, so... This is one of the first things I saw today. Let me go ahead and share my screen now for the people watching on OnlyFans. If you are listening in on YouTube, please remember, I'm queen of this channel, everything vulgar, and also your host, too persuasive. I'm also a little bit drunk because I hear it in my voice. If you're not a grown-up, you for real got to get out. Bye-bye. Sayonara. Adios. Peace is deuce. Don't let the door knob hit you with a good Lord split you. I mean, bye. You can't be here. You got to go. If you are an adult and you happen to like what you see here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Okay, here we go. Drunk news. Tracy Kwan. That's who said this, okay? Don't forget, the Atlanta shooting is a hate crime against sex workers. Now, why did she have to go ahead and say that? Like, some of us on the backside, like, yeah, we know the truth, okay? I don't know why I'm considered to be one of a sex, a sex worker, but I mean, I guess there are levels to everything, so I accept it. Not ashamed. So, here we go. Eight people were killed in Atlanta last Tuesday. We have no shortage of explanations, including the 
perpetrator's version of which many refuse to accept. Eros rebranded, vilified as a X edition. I have to say it like that because we are also now on YouTube. We're no longer on Twitch. Inspired a homicidal atrocity. It is just a beard for anti-Asian violence. Wow. So it's being compared to an actual beard. Y'all, we getting deep tonight. I ain't going nowhere. I don't know where my nights are. But yeah. Hold on. I'm going to do it like this. Screenshot this. Where is my freaking camera? I did something to my phone on accident, y'all. Wait, let me make sure my straps are visible because I'll be having problems. Oh, can I screenshot a picture? Oh, let's try it. Oh, shit. All right, since I have no evidence of anybody being here, I'm sorry to you guys that watch this after it uploads. Sorry to y'all on YouTube for the delay. I just figured something out. Ooh, y'all in trouble now. Hold on, let me go to my gallery and trim that damn screenshot. That was dope. Oh, it's perfect. I don't even have to trim it. Oh, my goodness. Okay, y'all. So, hold on. I'm about to make a real quick video and post it in the middle of the show. It's Friday. I did promise a longer show. Hey, 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 hey. Here we are. I got zero likes, zero comments, zero viewers on OnlyFans. I can now see y'all. I've got one viewer on YouTube, and that's because I've actually left the damn stream. I'm not there anymore, so me having one viewer is actually me having one somebody in the background listening, watching, whatever. If I check the studio and I look at the analytics, though, you never know. Might be more people hiding in the background. I'm figuring this shit out, y'all. Can't trick me no damn more. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. I'm going to read this article. This article is at Los Angeles Times. Dot com. It's in the entertain entertainment, arts, and book stories. <clears throat> I'm doing different things to keep her alive here because I don't want them to tell me that I'm going idle. But hold on. Of course, I'm making a new project. Mute my audio clip, even though I don't think there's any fucking audio on my clip.
Hold on, y'all. I'll be doing stuff. Quick video, quick video, y'all. Post it. Okay, so yeah, that's definitely not me in the um, YouTube chat. So whoever that is listening, thank you so much for sticking it in. I mean, sticking around. So it says, eight people were killed in Atlanta last Tuesday, which was really, really, really sad. We have no shortage of explanations, including perpetrator's virgin, which may refuse to accept Eros rebranded and vilified sex edition inspired a homicidal atrocity. It's just that beard for... Oh, we read all that. So, yeah. So, basically, they're saying that what they're calling a hate crime is a cover-up for crimes against sex workers. But don't worry. We have more on this. It's not over. Don't worry, I have more on this. It's not over. I'm just clicking. Give me a minute. Let's change her pose so we don't lose her. It got dark behind us and everything. It's like little almost. It was you know it was like dusky. It was almost dark. It wasn't dark when we started. So, this made me click on more things, trying to get to the bottom of it myself. So here we go. To those watching on OnlyFans, let me go ahead and share my screen. Okay, you guys see that? Let me go ahead and switch my monitor. We've got... Oh, we actually have people in the shadows. Okay. Hey to the people in the shadows on YouTube. Sorry, y'all, if you can't see me and that discouraged you from watching. Everything that I'm doing is in my title. What the hell? I'm still trying to share this video. Hold on. My screen blanked out. So, here we go. Oh, I think there's a video attached to this. So, I'm going to play the video. I guess here's the article way down here. And if the video doesn't load in and I never get to play the article, I'll have to read that. But what I'm going to do is stop my screen real quick. So, hold on. Oh, stream connection lost. Oh, that was on one monitor. Okay, I'm tripping. So, yep, yeah, I'll do that. Let it load in this way. Take some time, y'all. All right, hold on. All right, y'all, here we go. Here we 
go. All right, give me some time. It's loading. It's doing its thing. I call myself hitting the play button. My video didn't come out right. All right, let's go. Let's see if it's working. Okay, it's not me. Hold on. It's me, but it's not the computer. So. Oh, you motherfuckers try to get me, uh huh. Sorry, y'all. Sometimes things happen when you're live. Oh, they're not going to ever rewind this shit. All right, let's go. Like victims on Piedmont Road are being remembered as loving mothers and good friends. Channel 2's Chris Jose is live at the first murder scene in Cherokee County. And Chris, you talked to one woman's son today. I did, Lori and George. We drove out to Gwinnett County today. That's where a victim's son, Randy Park, is doing a round of interviews. Meanwhile, here in Cherokee County, you can see this memorial is growing by the day. There's everything here from flowers, balloons, and messages of hope. It was quite literally the only thing that kept us running, calling every night to check up on us before she goes to bed. In this picture with our two sons, Hyun Jung Grant has the look of a proud mother. A GoFundMe page has raised more than $1.1 million. On Friday, the Fulton County Medical Examiner released a name to the Atlanta spa shootings, including Grant's. The other women are Soon Park, Soon Cho Kim, and Young Yu. In all, eight people died, six were Asian women. Emily Tan and Young's Asian massage and... All right, y'all know I do things. We running it back twice if it works. It hurts a lot. The medical examiner said three of the Atlanta victims died from gunshot wounds to the head. One was shot in the chest. Their ages ranged from 51 to 74 years old. On Thursday, the Cherokee County Sheriff was in tears at a candlelight vigil. As a All right, hold on. We're four devastated. Um, our hearts and our I'm not running this back twice. It plays funny. The Cherokee County District Attorney released a statement that says, in part, as we work to bring justice for these victims, we are acutely aware of the feelings of terror being experienced in the Asian American community. We hear your concerns, and we want it to be known that these victims will receive the very best efforts of this office. And here is another live look at the growing memorial here in Cherokee County. The district attorney said her office will soon be meeting with the victims, with the victims' families to earn their trust and build this case up for prosecution. Live in Cherokee County, Chris Jose, Channel 2 Action News. Okay, y'all, so... That's what we know about the victims of these senseless massage parlor shootings. 
horrible, awful, tasteless, senseless act of violence. So, after this, we got the damn times with an opinion. And I agree. So, I'm going to share my screen. Y'all watching in a grown-up place going to understand. Yeah, I'm fucking up this granola bar right now. I don't care. What I'm saying, like, I agree. But it ain't just them. Every minority that's afraid for their life. Because of the way this country has showed their true colors. Because of all the recent twists and turns. Because a man was arrested outside of Kamala Harris' house with a rifle and ammunition inside his car. Every motherfucking American. That's a real American. Should be scared. What's crazy is, this isn't news. We actually been reporting on all kind of shit like this for a long damn time. This is not news. Okay, so, if you want to know, you can find this article at nytimes.com. I might not read through the whole thing, but I'm going to start, okay? Here we go. Asian Americans are scared for a reason. Now, it says bigotry and demo. I don't think it's, I don't know what the fuck is this. Demagoguing, demagoguing, demagoguing have pushed enemy communities to a crisis point. The grim reality of modern American life is that each new mass killing leads to fevered studies of motives and meaning. Was a latest student motivated by racism, misogyny, religion, revenge, or some combination thereof? Those are not questions that members of a healthy society should routinely be forced to ask or answer. After eight people, including six of Asian descent and seven women, were shot to death in Georgia this week, a deputy sheriff chalked the killings up to suspects' confused sex addiction. <clears throat> Whoa. He chalked it up to the suspe suspects confessed. <laughs> quote. End quote. Sex addiction. Now I said it twice on the channel. Hope we don't get in no trouble. Adding that yester yesterday was a really bad day for the alleged shooter. That diagnosis was met with the skepticism it deserved. The same deputy promoted to the sale of anti-Asian t-shirts that referred the coronavirus as an import from China, C-H-Y-N-A. 
It's difficult to disentangle the vile pathologies that lead a man to take so many innocent lives. It's also impossible to ignore the context in which the murderers were committed and the impact that the tragedy has had on so many communities across America. In an analysis of nearly 4,000 hate-related incidents targeting Asian Americans documented this year and last, Nearly 70% of the victims were women, according to a report by the group Stop AAPI Hate. New York was the second state behind California in the total number of incidents documented by the group. Quote, Among large American cities, end quote, the Times reports, quote, New York City has had the largest increase in reported hate crimes against agents last year, according to the analysis of police data by a center at California State University, San Bernardino. There were 28 such incidents in 2020, up from there in 2019, according to New York Police Department data. Now, Since we on my channel, and this is where I can, you know, use my voice. Okay. I'm going to say this. It does not matter how new it is for anybody that is ensuing this type of treatment and behavior. <clears throat> It'll never matter how new it is. Once you see that this is a pattern and this is happening to a certain demographic and a certain type and a certain hue of people, a certain people that look a certain way, then you have to address the matter as what it is. You have to accept the fact that this is a big deal and it shouldn't be happening. It shouldn't be happening to us. It shouldn't be happening to them. It shouldn't be happening to anybody of any race or skin tone or any type of... Um, um, nationality or any type of certain cultural group. It should not happen to religious groups. It should not happen. It should not happen on the basis of how you look, how you sound, how you walk. None of these things should happen to anybody because of who you were born as. You can't control that. I can't even play poker on Facebook like I used to because these people, they're really mad that I was born black. And I'm mixed and fuck all that because the other cultures would never accept me. I'm visibly black. I'm black. So, whatever. I really understand this plight. And yes, we have had this same issue for hundreds and hundreds of fucking years. Yes, it's new to them. It should not be happening. This shouldn't be happening to anybody. We want to fight for equality and want these things to happen to us, not to happen to us, but why would we allow this to happen to somebody fucking else when we know what the fuck it feels like and we don't think this should happen to anybody? So we special like that? This should not happen to us, but it's okay to turn your blind eye and look over the shoulder when it happens to somebody else? These things should not happen to anybody. I'm sorry if I'm yelling, but I'm telling you, I watched a few streams today when people was talking about, well, black people been going through this forever. Yes, we have. Which should make us more sympathetic. Yes, the fuck we have. We know exactly what it feels like. And nobody, nobody should treat anybody like that based on skin tone, characteristic, eye shape. I see them hearts, y'all. Too much shit in my blood. It's too much, too much shit in my blood for me to, to just let that happen to any motherfucking body. Because everybody got whatever I got in me and them. Shit, we all the damn same. I don't like that shit. Somebody just popped in because I checked over here. I can't, okay, I can't see who you are, but I can see I got one viewer and 27 likes. No comments yet. Okay, cool, cool. Thank you, thank you for popping in. 
next 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 topic <laughs> it's Friday let's go I'm just saying shit nobody should stand by and allow any of those things to happen I have turned my head in instances, but never nothing like that. Never nothing like that. Hold on, check this damn article out. I'm waiting for my screen to load. Come on, drop some hearts. I know you're here. I see you here, but I cannot tell who you are. If you comment, I'll be able to read your comment, but your name will be a number. I won't know who you are. Nobody will know who you are. Please interact. Because that's what makes this show a show. I got one viewer on YouTube. They quiet as hell. And they've been with me all day. I think it's the same person. Been watching all day. Okay, check this out. The White House tries to snuff out report on staffers who were let go for pot use. This is on NPR.org. Y'all watching? I'm waiting for them hearts. I see I got one viewer. Alright, hold on. Let me go ahead and join the YouTube chat so that I can go ahead and remind people that this channel is for adults and adults only. If you're not a grown-up, even though you can't see me, you still gotta get out. Bye-bye, adios, deuces, peace. If you are an adult and you happen to like what you see here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so that you don't miss out on all the awesome things that happen at this channel. Including our sometimes, awesome not very frequent, happened. not very often, but only sometimes giveaway. Still got one viewer on OnlyFans. Still feel like being quiet, huh? Telling you, y'all can comment now. I will be able to see your comments. Just waiting. All right, here we go. The White House says five employees were let go from their jobs related to past marijuana use, even though personnel policies were updated so that past pot use would not automatically bar people from working there. Responding to a Daily Beast report about the issue, White House Press Secretary Jen Psaki said on Friday on Twitter, the bottom line is this, of the hundreds of people hired, only five people who have started working at the White House are no longer employed as a result of this policy. Psaki pointed to a recent NBC report on the new guidelines which were negotiated because marijuana use is legal in some places in the United States, but remains illegal under federal law. Boo! Boo! I think that's as deep as I could go. I was trying to get deep. Well, here we go. <clears throat> Boo! Yeah, I did it! That's sexy. Oh shit, I done wet my chin up. Okay. Here we go. Jen Psaki. We announced a few weeks ago that the White House had worked with the security service to update the policies to ensure that past marijuana use wouldn't automatically disqualify staff from serving in the White House. There is a link here in parentheses to go to NBCnews.com, but I ain't clicking it. Here we go. Jen Psaki. These are her Twitter comments when you hear me say her name like that. She just sounds like a Mortal Kombat character because I've been playing it recently, so I just want to say her name that way. Jen Psaki. As a result, more people will serve who will not have in the past with the same level of recent drug use. That's not drugs, bitch! Okay, she's a Republican. 
The bottom line is this, the hundreds of people who were hired, only five people who had started working at the White House are no longer employed as a result of this policy. Uh, da, da, da. Her using the term drug bit use is like real fucked up. Fuck her. I don't do drugs, bitch. I smoke weed. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Thank you for them hearts. I see you. I really would appreciate if you had any thoughts or any comments on these topics that you go ahead and comment now or any way you would normally reach me the same as before. But now, we ain't got to do all that. We ain't got to do all that, y'all. I can see you. I can see you now. I can see you. But can you see me? Hey. Do you see me? Am I even here? Do you see me? All right, here we go. Cuomo. Oh, shit. I'm sorry, y'all. And no. All right, Cuomo faces new claims of sexual harassment from current aid. Not a past employee. Not somebody that was there a couple of weeks ago. Now the lady that is recently and has been working for him for some time now. She is claiming sexual harassment. And I am so disappointed. I was trying to give this poor man the benefit of the doubt. Hey, no! Hi, Nell. See, all you had to do was comment. Sorry, y'all had some business to tend to. A little bit quiet on YouTube. Here we go. No, they want me to um create an account. But hold on. Uh-uh. I'm typing, y'all. All right, let's try the Washington Post since that article didn't want to work for me. So we're looking at the Washington Post now. Cuomo faces new allegations of misbehavior by another female employee. <clears throat> Man, it's another one. Hold on. See, that's what I'm saying. That's that BS. Everything wants you to pay for it. But yeah. He had all those people after him before. Now he's got a new allegation. This aide, Alyssa McGrath, accused Governor Andrew Cuomo of ogling her body, remarking on her looks, and making suggestive comments to her and another woman in his office. Like, okay, let me tell you guys something. Yes, that's wrong. Yes, that's wrong. But as a real person who's had real shit happen to them, I'm so tired of all this shit about words and said, Did the motherfucker touch you? Wait, I'm trying to be concerned here. Did he do something to you? Are you hurt? 
did he really violate your fucking person the way I have had my person violated before in my life? Like, did the motherfucker do something to you? Did he do something to you? Now, the other allegations are way deeper and way more fucked up. And I'm not saying that these aren't fucked up, but they aren't that fucked up to be all this newsworthy like that. Let's let everything pile on the motherfucking court case then. Take the motherfucker to court. Press charges. Do what y'all gotta do. Let's get proof. Let's get validation. Let's get this shit done right. But some of this shit's starting to be cut sketchy. And I never want to be a victim shame person. But Lord... Are you fucking serious? I've had my face bashed in. Because something was physically happening to me. Are you fucking serious? Fuck out of here. Oh, he said this and he said that. Motherfuckers have said lots of shit to me. Shit, I got a thick skin. I have had people do things to me. You got to be fucking kidding me. Now, what does that leave people like me? Where does that leave us standing when we have actually had physical costumes and shit like that? We've actually had to fight for my life. And I'm this pretty because I'm a whole G. No, I just want to, I just, I was really waiting for this article to say that. Like, I, sh what about people like me? They really ought to show you got hands. Because you look like me. Now, this shit is funny. I hope I don't get a copyright strike on YouTube. But YouTube won't be able to see this video. The only people that will be able to see this video is OnlyFans. Okay? So, hold on. I'm going to let this play. I'm just waiting for it to load up. Y'all know how things work slow. Hold on. All we really have is audio. I'm hoping the audio doesn't pick up as someone else's audio. Because I'm quite sure... Because we start at night time. I'm quite sure this is already aired several times today in several fucking places. So maybe I have the fair use thing going for me here. Other than that, I don't know. But we about to laugh at this shit. Lightens the mood. I placed this here on purpose because I knew I was going to be upset reading this, that damn story. So hold on, y'all. I'm stopping the screen, you know, just to make things load faster. Stopping the screen, reloading. I see we still got one viewer. I know who it is. Thank you so much for being a great night. Sticking it in. Ah, sticking it in. I mean, sticking around. Hey, we still on YouTube. Thank you so much for sticking it in. I mean, sticking around. Please remember that this channel is for adults and adults only. Yeah, the ad is what's going to give it up. If I could get the damn mute going. Nope, not in time. There we go. Thank you guys so much for sticking it in. I mean, sticking around. Please remember that this channel is for adults and adults only. I'm starting to sound sobered up, so I'm going to fix it. <laughs> That's all right, y'all. We're going to play this more than once. So if we have to watch it on mute the first time, we'll just have to do so. Sorry, y'all. We are watching Biden stumble up the stairs. I know he's our president, but it's fucking funny. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. I really wish I knew how to stop that, but they gonna pop up all the notifications. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here.
can't dust the knees off, Lord. I can't do it. Like, I, when I first watched this, I was in my heart. Like, any comments, nobody laughing. Y'all know that shit was funny. One more again. Uh, you know I got to do it again. One more time, y'all. Yeah, we watching sense. Biden stumble up the stairs. Here we go. He walking so smooth. He look good. Ain't nothing going on. Oh, Mr. President. Oh, Lord, I got to take a shot. He going up. He going to the stairs. Oh, Jesus, I know what's about to happen next. Lord, not my president, Lord. should have been right there at that second step behind him already ready to scoop him up and help him lord have mercy okay here's my theory y'all let me get that up out that sound is just irritating okay so let me get that up out of here this is my theory y'all here we go let me tell y'all what i think All right, so here's what I think. My theory is he stumbled lots of times before. Ain't no way in hell somebody about to watch some older person that they feel like they're responsible for their well-being or any older person that's around them, period. Watch their ass stumble three times like that and don't be ready behind, behind them like, you know, like an egg on a teaspoon. So... He done stumbled before in other places and he snapped on people already for trying to pick him up. He said, I ain't no motherfucking invalid. God damn it, what the fuck you touching me for? That's my theory. He said, I got this, bitches. What the fuck you touching me for? Why are you touching me? I got this. I'm the POTUS. How dare you try to lift me up from my anguish, bitch. <laughs> How dare out of you. That's the fuck he said. That was horrible, y'all. Poor man. Oh, let me hurry. I'm sorry, y'all. I just looked over at the um thing. Like, I don't need this anymore either. Y'all know it's Topless Talk Live episode 130, but not really. My bad. I didn't realize that I still had um, the banner up on the screen. Okay, so here we go. Oh, I meant to share that. Here we go. Next article, y'all. Changing her pose. I think I might actually have to take my avatar somewhere else. So, I don't feel like driving. About to do this the lazy way. So you guys see that headline? Instagram and WhatsApp are back online after an outage this afternoon. Facebook's apps experienced some serious, blah, 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 serious issues as well. But look, check it out. I didn't have any problems. I don't know if all this happened during my nap time because uh, earlier this afternoon I took a nap. Maybe around 12. It had to be around noon because I had breakfast and then I was just like, eh, eh, I just go to sleep, right? So I took a nap and then I woke up and I played for like an hour and a half and I went to the store, which was around 4.30. So it had to be around noon. So I don't know what time this outage was, but... Here we go. What's it? I don't like WhatsApp. 
I don't have WhatsApp anymore. Everybody that's ever asked me about if I have WhatsApp is somebody that sent me a dick pic before they even said hello to me. Or somebody that was trying to fake like they were a certain celebrity and then they asked me to send them some money for some studio time and I laugh at they ass like, are you serious? Because I thought something was wrong. I actually know this particular celebrity and his wife and they just like left me to fuck alone. Thanks for your patience. That was a long 45 minutes, but we're back. This article is on Engadget.com. The source of the outage wasn't immediately clear, but WhatsApp and Instagram seemed to be most affected. While they were down, both apps were unable to refresh with WhatsApp stuck, quote unquote, connecting. Likewise, Instagram displayed an error message that it couldn't refresh feed. Users also reported issues accessing Facebook and Messenger, according to DownDetector.com, which tracks service outages. Yeah. I don't have no problems. None. Might have been during my nap time. They weren't meant to affect me. I am in the clouds badly, y'all. All right, slowly but surely going down the list. Here we go. I guess they're saying that Zuckerberg is saying this himself. Facebook could be in a stronger position after Apple tracking change. This change is expected to come with iOS 14.5 within just a few weeks. Apple CEO Tim Cook on stage during an Apple event in September 2018. That was two years ago. So why are we going back two years? This article was updated today at 1.04 p.m. All right, let's just read the article. I'm probably not going to read the whole thing. You guys can find this article at <clears throat> arstechnica.com, A-R-S-T-E-C-H-N-I-C-A.com. With Apple's big app tracking policy change just around the corner, Chinese companies drew a warning from Cupertino that made their effects circu circumvent the change that will not be successful. At the same time, Facebook CEO Mark Zuckerberg appeared to shift his messaging about the change. Several months ago, Apple announced that it will require user opt-in for IDFA, Identifier for Advertisers, a tool that advertisers use to identify and track users across apps and websites. If users opt-in, it will be a business tool as usual, but they, if they decline, the app will, in question will not be able to use that tracking method. The change will apply to all iPhone and iPad apps and it will take full effect in iOS 14.5, which is due out sometime in the next few weeks. All right, so there is more to this article. Quite a bit more. Alright y'all, we gonna go, 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 keep on going. I am moving to something else. But yeah, there's quite a bit more in that article. And as I said, you guys can find it, as you see right there on the screen. Ars Technica, A-R-S, 
T-E-C-H-N-I-C-A dot com. Here we go. The accused Pete Davidson stalker is allegedly barraged himself, uh, barraged Pete Davidson, I'm assuming, with unwanted gifts. Okay, so you guys, we are waiting for things to load as normal. I am, I got it. Yeah. A blunt. Oh shit, did she finally land somewhere? Looks like she got a nice view right here. Let's have a seat. All right, so this article right here is at page6.com. Nell, are you still here? Can I get some hearts? Still telling me I got one viewer. Two viewers on YouTube. Thank you guys so much for sticking it in. I mean, sticking around. Please remember that this channel is for adults and adults only. If you're not a grown-up, I'm going to need you to get out. Bye-bye. Sayonara. Kick rocks. Don't let the door not pitch you with a good Lord split you. I mean, bye, deuces, peace. You gots to go. If you are an adult and you happen to like what you see here, go ahead, hit that subscribe button so that you don't miss out on all the awesome things that happen at this channel. There we go. All right, so, and that still hasn't loaded. The woman busted for entering Saturday Night Live star Pete Davidson's Staten Island home had previously sent him a barrage of unwanted gifts. Prosecutors revealed in court on Friday as a judge slapped a restraining order on the suspect. Oh, this is a name. Forgive me, y'all, as I try to pronounce this. Michelle Mutretti. I think I did that right. I'm not sure. But I think I did that right. Let me go ahead and put that where I won't break it. And change her pose. Okay, Michelle Mutretti sat behind a screen of white metal bars as she was arraigned. On burglary, trespass, stalking, and harassment raps during the virtual hearing in Richmond County Criminal Court. Before she was freed on supervised release. Oh, they don't let the crazy bitch go. They don't let the crazy half out, y'all. Oh, Lord. Y'all better pray for Pete Davidson. Tell y'all, I had a stalker and they kept letting his ass out and the motherfucker kept coming back. Anywho, quote, in this case, the defendant engaged in conduct that involved numerous instances of stalking, including sending letters and packages to the home of Peter Davidson, as well as subsequently entering the home without permission, end quote, said Assistant District Attorney Matthew Stupp. I am rolling up as I read, y'all, so forgive me. Okay. Judge Rado Castarina Ronald <laughs> Ronald Castarina Jr. Freed Mutretti on supervised release after the brief hearing while issued 
issuing a restraining order in favor of Davidson. Oh, that bitch crazy. His little sister, Cassie Dave Casey Davidson, and mom, Amy Waters. Oh, so she's got to stay away from everybody. This bitch been fucking with people. And they let her go? You can't just tell the law, hey, this crazy bitch is stalking me. And they just, they just let her ass go. All right, there's only a little bit left on this article, y'all. And this is... One more time, one more again, at page6.com. Let me go ahead and switch her pose. We're going to get through this without going idle. Now, look. Did y'all know? That there is now a four-part Justice League on HBO Max. And I'm using someone's account so I can't share it with y'all. I'm not going to read this article at all. But I want y'all to catch this headline. It says, Falcon and a Winter Soldier's final scene reveal is a classic Captain America story. This article is on Polygon.com. They actually talk about the new version, which is on HBO Max, the four-part Snyder version. I'm scrolling for people to see on the site, but I don't want to read any spoilers to fuck it up for myself, y'all. So I'm not reading this article. I'm just scrolling down if anybody is interested because this is this type of shit we talk about all the time. And y'all know. Ooh. Go ahead, Mackie. All right. So let me go ahead and... Uh, let me go ahead and... I hope they don't flag me for this. I think I gotta stop my scream to make this load faster. Hold on, y'all. I would do my best if to tune myself out. This way, we'd be seeing a brand new Batman at the Hold end on. of his Justice League Of course, League I'm gonna rewind trilogy. her. Zack Snyder's Justice League dropped yesterday on HBO Max, and it is filled with a ton of detail. Well, setting up events Hold in on. future movies. Oh, yeah. My cursor is not doing shit. I always Boiler show my alert. support. For anyone who hasn't seen all four hours of the new... If Zack Snyder had his way, we'd be seeing a brand new Batman at the end of his Justice League trilogy. Spoiler alert! Zack Snyder's Justice League dropped yesterday on HBO Max, and it is filled with a ton of detail setting up events in future movies. Oh, yeah. Spoiler alert for anyone who hasn't seen all four hours of the new Justice League just yet. I said that already. Halfway through the Snyder Cut, we have a scene with Lois Lane in her apartment, alone. Superman had died just a few months earlier, fighting Doomsday, and she's obviously missing him. In a drawer, there's a quick glimpse of a they got her look at Oh, y'all. Judging by the title of this video you're watching right now, it's probably positive. Now, fast forward to the end, and Bruce and Clark she are at way the older than me. Before we leave I'm the old. scene, Bruce casually says, Congratulations, by the way. We can infer from this and from the pregnancy test that Lois is pregnant with Clark's baby. Now, how does this lead to a new Batman? Speaking to Vanity Fair, Zack Snyder explained... His his original vision for the DCEU, in which there would have been a Justice League trilogy of films, ending with Batman's death. Alright, so, I'm gonna talk and fast forward a bit, y'all. 
I have to do that because I'm on YouTube, but still, like, are you serious? And plus, because I want to cut out some kind of spoilers for myself, so here we go. ...of Batman's death, they take young Bruce Kent down to the Batcave and they say, your Uncle Bruce would have been proud if you did this, end quote. Wow, okay, and I thought it was a lot that my parents wanted me to be a lawyer. Girl, shut up. A reboot as much as it is a sequel to the 2016 Suicide Squad. Okay, and so, um, you want to yeah, this basically, Batman show that I like, let us that part. So, we have been running for an hour and 10 minutes here, an hour and 53 minutes on YouTube. What I'm gonna do is take her, stand her up. We still live in both places. Get up, girl. Take her, stand her up, walk her to somewhere, place someplace else into the room. Let's, oh, not the bathroom. I wish I could get in that tub. I swear I would do streams in that tub. Oh, speaking of, I got a place we could go. Somebody, forgive me for that, told me that the water was too loud, but they hardly come. They not here. If they are, they tell me late. They're not watching while we live. Fuck it. Priority of this is live. Hey, I don't need my hair done. I just wanted to say hi. What it? All right. Okay, let's have a seat over here and we are gonna poke around and be nosy. Still says I got a viewer on OnlyFans. Hey y'all. I still only have 66 likes, so I think he left. I am poking around and being nosy at the moment. I am typing into my Google browser, theshaderoom.com. I'll tell y'all. Okay, let me look and see what's going on here. I actually do think I'm alone. Even though I'm actually not anywhere on YouTube, even though I should be. Let me do this. Okay. I joined. And now... I'm going to make a comment. <clears throat> Poking around. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay, I'm going to read this article. And everybody's been talking about Pierce Morgan. But I'm telling you, and even looking at this head headline for this new um, article about him, he's starting to seem more and more racist. I'm just saying. I found this on the shaderoom.com. Even though I told you guys I was going to the shade room. I'm going to tell y'all anyway. This is on the shaderoom.com. In the TSR entertainment section. So, let's go. Pierce Morgan calls out Gail King 
and claims she's being the PR mouthpiece for Meghan Markle and Prince Harry. First off, y'all, I be mad when people try to put me in my best friend shit. I really do, okay? He over there doing whatever the fuck he want to do. Whatever what bitches he doing shit with. Look, I don't care. We cool. We still good. That's my best friend. Like, he doing whatever the fuck. Why you trying to put me in his shit? I don't know. Just watch it. Pay that money. Shit, I don't know. So, I am going to stand up for Gail King in this instance. Okay? So, here we go. It says, where's my damn thing here? Let me, I gotta switch poses and stuff and make sure we good. Gotta move her around. Make sure we don't go idle here. And I'm gonna put this here so I can just click easy. Alright, so check it. And this is the shade room. They say, as you all know, Pierce Morgan walked away from his job at Good Morning Britain after he was confronted for highly criticizing Meghan Markle following her Prince Harry's, her and Prince... I'm sorry. This is a prominent website. These have been reporting news for years. And I know I speak with a certain rhetoric. And I know that I speak Ebonics, but hell no. I'm going to go back and I'm going to read this in proper English because I'm reporting news right now, okay? Hold on. Shay Room. Shay Room, you ought to be ashamed of yourself. As you all know, recently Pierce Morgan walked away from his job at Good Morning American, I mean, Good Morning Britain after he was confronted by Heidi criticizing Mary Markle for she. That's a correction. After he was confronted for highly criticizing Meghan Markle following she, not her, she and Prince Harry's interview with Oprah Winfrey earlier this month. She, bitch. Sorry. Had a moment. Well, it looks like Pierce is far from done when it comes to speaking about that particular topic. And it says replay. We never watched a video, so let's hit the replay button. No. Okay, on Wednesday, Pierce took to Twitter to call out... He took to Twitter to call out Gail King, who was a friend of Meghan and Harry, who has been providing updates on the progress of their relationship. Anybody, blah, 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 blah. I'm going to press this play button here. As we learn more about the royal family's reaction to Prince Harry and Meghan's explosive interview with Oprah, Sunday Times of London royal correspondent Roy and Nika I'll be back, Prince Harry and Prince William had been in contact for the first time since the interview aired. Harry reportedly hopes to reconcile with his brother before the unveiling of a memorial to their mother, Princess Diana, later this summer. Comments Harry made during the interview have left their mark. His father, Prince Charles, is reported to be, quote, upset and cut up. The inside look at the family's reaction comes as Buckingham Palace has hired an external law firm to investigate claims Meghan bullied royal staff. Gail, you spoke with the couple over the weekend. Let's break some news. What they say? Well, I'm not trying to break news, but I did actually call them to see how they were feeling. And it's true. Harry has talked to his brother and he has talked to his father, too. Uh, the word I was given was that the, those conversations were not productive. But they are glad that they're, they have at least started a conversation. And I think... What is still upsetting to them is that the palace keeps saying they want to work it out privately, 
But yet they Always believe these leaks. false stories are coming out that are very disparaging against Meghan still. No one is in the royal family has talked to Meghan yet uh, at this particular time. And I think it's frustrating for them to see that it's a racial conversation about the royal family when all they wanted all along was for the royals to intervene and tell the press to stop with the unfair inaccurate false stories that definitely have a racial slant and until you can acknowledge that I think it's going to be hard to move forward but they both want to move forward with this and they both want you know they want healing in this family At the end of the day that is Harry's family and no word as to whether the palace is investigating what Megan said about the mental health the reaching out for mental health or the racist language that was used. But they are investigating it, the bullying, the bullying accusations, is, and apparently the Sussexes have not been invited to, or not expected to be part of that investigation themselves. That's right. Yeah, yes. That's what we're learning. Yes. That's another thing. You know, the bullying thing was raised, you know, in 2018, and now there's an ongoing investigation about bullying for Meghan Markle. When yeah. anyone who's worked with her will tell you exactly who she is, you know, she's really a very sweet, caring person. And as I say, Meghan has documents to back up everything that she said on Oprah's interview. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all heard that. Y'all heard that, that, right? Yeah. Megan right. has well, documents well, to well, back well, up well. everything that she said on Oprah's interview. Y'all heard that? Good. If you heard it, I'm glad. Good, because we are going to go right back into playing some shenanigans. And what I'm going to do is we are now gaming <laughs> gaming topless. I'm going to end this stream here on OnlyFans so that I don't have any problems uploading and downloading things. And then I'm going to restart. So you guys will get both streams late tonight, early in the morning, same as, you know, the days before. And yeah, we're doing that. So I'm ending and then I'm going back to GTA. But you guys will be joining me this time. All right, y'all, I'm here. Let's get up. My camera will be remaining off. I will be continuing with the shenanigans. I'm gonna go ahead. Uh-oh, hold on, let me get a drink. We need a drink. Let me go ahead and get a drink. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to continue with shenanigans. But I'm going to go ahead and take my mic off of, you know, public chat. All right. We are in private party chat. There we go. Her mouth ain't moving no more. Alright, I think I'm going to do one intro and a 30 second countdown. I've made myself my own um, filing codes and everything like, oh, shit, this shit is serious. Oh, she gonna fall out, y'all. We still good over there, though. All right, so how am I going to do this? I am actually going to switch my monitors back. Take the left one and just run my channel so I can see myself, as, you know, but as a monitor and narcissist. narcissist. <laughs> ah, 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 drug lady. Okay, let's go. Hold on.
All right, so now I'm already on StreamYard. I am coming to the chat. Ooh, ooh. ooh, it's three people here. Hey, 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 y'all. I'm drunk. It's Friday. Let's go. Hit that like button, y'all. I got quite a few viewers. I see people in the shadows, but I only got one like. Hold on, y'all. Messages. All right, sorry, y'all. I am going into the YouTube studio. Yeah, type it on a YouTube, on a um, PlayStation takes a long time. I'm about to share my screen. Hold on. Uh, 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 uh. All right. 
<laughs> I got a lot going on, y'all. Y'all don't know. It's like, it's work to do all this shit. I'm sharing as TP less GTA. Hold on. Hope they get it. Hold on, y'all. Okay, I'm waiting for things to load in. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, so Wait, hold on, y'all. I'm having a problem. So, guess what happened? Some kind of fucked up glitch. So, I don't know how long people on um, OnlyFans got of the show. I might actually have to fucking sit and take the time. <laughs> I sound drunk now after drinking all this damn time too. To sit and review the show. And actually see how much has been recorded. But. You know what? I know I was live because I was looking to see who was there, who wasn't there. So here we go. Let's share GTA. Woo woo! Oh, you miss everything, including me getting toe up over here. Wait, wait, not that bad, but. Hold on, give me a second. There's people here, I don't know who they are. Cause I ain't talking. I know I sound drunk. Cause I've been drinking. I've been drinking. I've been drinking. Yeah. Drunk lady. 
Let's go. Thank you, Ryder. Hold on one second. I was trying to find a um session, but uh, yeah. So give me a minute. I need you to stay just for a minute. I've got to reset my settings. I got put out for a second, so I got to do everything over. I know I did the whole show, though, but I have to watch it before I upload it to make sure everything, I did everything. Okay, let's find a lobby. Give me a second. Yep, I know I did that once already, y'all, but, you know, things happen. Come on, Pepper, you want to go outside? Come on. Okay, I got um, zero viewers in that place. We got people over here. So, y'all want me to turn my camera on? What you gonna make for dinner? Yep, I yawned. Okay, we out in this place. But not really. So. I am sharing my screen so people on OnlyFans can see the game. I'm pulling my top up, but I'm not putting on no over-the-shoulder boulder holder. Fuck that. Fuck all that. Okay. All right. Ooh, Lord. 
Y'all hear me moving the camera, right? Uh -oh. Oh, wow. <laughs> Damn, okay, I'm late. Alright. They don't like for real delay on OnlyFans. And that's good with me. So here we go. I'm coming, y'all. Ooh. That's what she said. <laughs> I am not disabling passive mode. Y'all ready? Who ready? My hair dried too. It was all silky when it was wet. <laughs> it was. It was. <laughs> Alright y'all. Here we go. What we doing? All right, I see y'all out there. If you came here, <laughs> To catch the audio for Topless Talk Live, it has already ended. You know, them things don't last forever. It was a good show. And yeah, I do save all my lives. Okay, let's try to get some mo arena wars in. Oh, I didn't kill him. <laughs> hey, hey, get it, get it. this car <laughs> all right what y'all doing out there happy Friday to everybody I hope everybody's doing well please remember I'm queen of this channel everything vulgar ooh wreck it and also your host too persuasive I'm a little bit drunk if you're not a grown-up get out bye bye sayonara kick rocks don't let the doorknob hit you with a good lord split you out me. Bye bye, deuces. Peace. You got to go. Get up out of here with your boochie teeth. <laughs>
Yeah. All that somebody said. This channel is for adults and adults only. If you are an adult and you happen to like what you see here, it's Friday. Go ahead and hit that like button. I know I'm a whole intoxication. Hit that like button now. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Long ass loading screen, long ass loading screen. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. And long ass loading screen, long ass loading screen. What, what, and work, bitch, work, bitch, work. Work, 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 bitch, work, bitch, work. Work. Hey, get it, get it, get it. <laughs> get it, get it, get it. Long ass loading screen. Uh, uh, uh. Long ass loading screen. Uh. Hey, he said, and if you're not an adult, then get kick rocks and go to bed. Yeah, you gotta get up out of here. Yeah, I'm starting to dry. I'm starting to feel like me. Fluffity duffity. Yeah, wake up here. The fuck was that? What the fuck was that you was trying to do, huh? Wake up here. Wake up. Get it, get it, get it, and work. And work, and one, and two, and get it, get it, get it, get it, work, 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 work. Yeah, I think I'm frozen, y'all. Hold on. Hold on. Y'all know I'll be doing, uh. Yep, I might have to restart. Frozen, 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 bitch, frozen, 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 shit, hey, hey, get it, get it, ooh, I felt that, I felt that, I felt that, I felt that, hey, Tell me nothing. Yeah. Oh, oh, let's go. Let's get it. Check this out, GTA. Get your shit together before I leave you for somebody else. Hold on, y'all. Let's see if I can do something. Oh, Lord. Why y'all want to do me like this? I got zero viewers in my grown-up place. Where y'all at? Nobody saying nothing. Am I feeling myself tonight? Yes, I am, sir. 
just I didn't I had to I see my roots are crazy because I didn't realize how much brighter my hair is than black. It looked crazy, but I'm gonna dye it tomorrow. That's why I washed it. Cause I got the kind of hair I gotta get all the oils and grease and gels and all the shit about my hair before I dye it. But I can't dye it the same day. Yeah. So I'm gonna grease my scalp before I go to bed real good. And grease my scalp real good. And then I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna roll them ends. The roll the oil all the way to the ends. And then I'm gonna dye my hair. Black. Black. The color I always been dyeing my hair for like three years now. Everybody was saying, oh, when you start turning gray, dye your hair blonde because it blends in. And it did. But it was a lot of damage on my natural hair. And I, I got to have hair up under my hair. If I don't know. See, I think that only makes sense to black people. <laughs> I don't even want to say it that way, but I got to have hair up under my hair. So when I put my hair on, I got to have like this or more or something. You know, I got to have enough to braid it because I be sewing my hair on. So I got to have enough hair to put some hair on. And the blonde was about to make that impossible. I was about to be like, ski ball. Couldn't have braided my hair with a piece the size of rice. I'm just saying. So. I'm tempted though. I really did like myself blonde. And so did a lot of people like. I made money when I went blonde. Pat my head. I was saying, well, what was liking me blonde? I might. I might go like a light brown, like a sandy brown, but not, I'm not going, I can't do that no more. I don't have that kind of money. That shit was, ooh, if you want to keep some hair on your head, yeah, you got to spend some money. No, I already knew it. Damn, I should have changed my spawn location, but then I hit the X button. <laughs> I mean, half a second too late. What y'all doing? All right. Who is watching? Let the queen get a little head. I mean, a little head count, please. Y'all know I love me some good hair. I mean, a good hair count. You know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> he damn right. I'm feeling myself. <laughs> chee -chee. chee chee chee. A birthday coming up, though. I'm about to press my hair, y'all. I mean, I'm just getting ready. It's going to be crazy. after When I wake up in the morning, it's going to be crazy as fuck. I'm going to have to put this shit in two braids or something. Because, yeah, it's going to be wild. All right. One more try. And if this don't work... Then we're just going. <laughs> Thank you. I don't mind that. Each and every knight and every single soldier has my full permission to shine their sword at any given time. All y'all, anybody, anybody, and everybody, shine your sword at any given time. I'm queen of this channel, everything vulgar, and also your host, too persuasive. 
This channel is for adults and adults only. If you're not a grown up, get out. If you are an adult and you happen to like what you see here, go ahead, hit that subscribe button. Same thing, same thing. It's Friday, I'm drunk and yada, yada, yada. Let's go. Let's see what happens here. I'm unreal. I hope to be relatable. I don't want to be unreal. Mm -mm. I'm being me. But thank you for the compliment. <laughs> I don't want to be unreal. I hope to be relatable because uh, I've been drinking. I've been drinking. Okay, y'all. <laughs> Do I have any nights in the room? Can somebody say something here? I need to know I'm not alone. I hope you are an adult. Nice to meet you, Jesse. Thank you so much for the compliments. I la la love compliments. Oh. Oh, okay. He said relatable, but out of this world at the same time. <laughs> uh huh. Mm hmm. Oh, girl, keep, keep them people out your toiletry business. Oh, Lord. Okay, yeah, it's too many people in this lobby. We just gonna fuck around and let's go. Get up out of here real quick. My hair is almost dry, y'all. Like, it's about to throw out. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> it's almost dry. Ooh, that middle's gonna be a mess. Yeah. Ooh, I'm about to straighten my hair on the weekend, though. Like, I'm really gonna press my hair. Like, no, like, really, like. <sighs> with the hot comb, like, all up in it, like. Ooh, yeah, I'm about to straighten this shit, y'all. And I got less than 11 and a half days for my birthday. Do I like the tattoo on my character? Hold on. They're not going to let me showcase this shit. I, ooh, I'm trying to show off your tattoo, girl. It's a playing card. Well, it's two playing cards with guns. I'm trying to show it. But, uh, whatever. Let me make sure I am up on every platform. Okay. To y'all watching on OnlyFans, can y'all throw up some hearts so I know y'all here? Says I got two viewers. Yeah, I put my top on because they wanted to see me in a camera in other places. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, trying to see me with clothes on, you know? Maybe I hurt y'all eyes. I don't know. Hey, 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 girl. Where you going? Right, get in the damn boat. Okay, we in passive mode. They can't... What? <laughs> I was about to say they can't fuck with us, but they still can't, so... Uh-uh, no you don't. Are you serious? I 
can't be the only one. Yep, handle that thug thizzle. Make sure you hit the like and subscribe button so that you can do it every single time. I'm just saying. Age restrictions are set on this channel, buddy. <laughs> All right, let's take our chances. Call the mechanic. What you need, boss? Some wheels? I can bring them around. Oh, come out. Damn. Are you serious? It did not want to come out the package, y'all. That was not me. I swear. I tried in the beginning, but then it just got, you know, <clears throat> hard. I mean, difficult. All right, I'll get back to work. Hey, no, you don't. Through to your garage. You, uh, need me to bring you a ride? You chup. Chup, chup, chup. I'll bring it by. Mm-hmm. Okay, quick tip. Don't use words like polishing and stuff like that. If I can see your message on the computer, but I can't see it on PlayStation, then it's a warning for me, so you gotta be careful. You can shine it. Mm -hmm. Clean it vigorously. Can't use words like polishing. Almost done, y'all. Yeah, you were real quiet. I thought you left me. Thank you, Ryder. Hey, hey, hey. Go second night. Oh, I'm safe. I'm protected. Good, because I was trying to roll up. And I really did think as, um, like, as far as the defense aspect of everything, I thought I was alone. I really did. You know I'll be ready. I'll be ready, though. Tap that bottle two times for two time. Rest in peace, my brother. <laughs> I would say I'm done, but I think I would lie if I said that, boy. I'm drinking. It's Friday. I've been drinking. I've been drinking. Uh-oh. Hold on. Okay, we're taking our chances. We're driving the deluxe. So, uh-oh. What's about to happen? We are also live in the only place. One viewer. Somebody left when I called him out. I mean, y'all could say y'all there. I might turn the camera off and go from here to there. You know what I'm saying? And from there to here. I'm just saying, like, send a tip. Say hello. You never know. Anybody want that information that is on the bottom of the game stream?
fuck it. I don't know what kind of friends I got in my session. Hey, 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 get it. Kidnap that ass. Take him with me, with me. Oh, 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 no, no, no. Hey, wait, what happened? I said no. Oh, that means having to wear glasses. <laughs> My thumbnail? Okay, well then something's wrong and then YouTube did not accept my thumbnail. So let me see something. Because my thumbnail should be my GTA promo pick. Well, you shouldn't watch intently. People used to watch intently when things were might maybe happen then. But things can't happen on this channel anymore. <laughs> so ain't no uh FCS. No quick flashes, no none of that shit no more. And we've been here for a long time. Okay, my thumbnail is a GTA picture. <laughs> Yeah, I can't change it. I'm using a PlayStation camera, so. I'm not like on a computer or anything like that. I'm actually playing on PS4. And this is as big as my camera will go. Yet and still, I'm still going. They can't stop me. I can make my camera big in the other place where I'm like that, but that's an adult area, and I'm not sure you're an adult yet. It is only $4.99 a month to um, visit us there. Uh -oh. Hang out with us there. Catch each and every episode of Topless Talk Live. $4.99 a month. Okay, I'm running to my car. I've never done this fucking mission, so... Uh-huh. When I come, when I just like go into contact missions, that's when I catch shit I've never done before. So we'll see. Damn, my hair did blow up. Let's get some jams.
Swear he's singing about me. Doing nothing but the same shit I do every damn day. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Hey! It's never supposed to be easy. It's always supposed to be hard. I mean, difficult. Please remember that I'm queen of this channel, Everything Vulgar, and also your host, Too Persuasive. Remember that this channel is supposed to be for adults only. I don't know what's happening right now because I don't know who the hell I'm talking to. Let's go. <laughs> die you know what come on girl get your shit together why you got no gun out girl oh it's about to blow up damn I noticed it right before my my top was gonna fall off though y'all was trying to get some easy viewing and shit now it don't work like that <laughs> okay, do that. You do that. See how many times I get shot. <laughs> that sounds like a fun game. I like it. <laughs> Oh, that's a lot. You never gonna get your business handled. Cause I'm gonna miss some shit. <laughs> I'm 
I'm gonna miss a lot of shit. Know how much you complimented me, Tom? Already, you you, you don't know what you're doing. <laughs> I'm not trying to get out either. Damn, that took a long damn time. <laughs> oh, shit, my hair almost dry, y'all. I'm gonna have to put some juices and berries in this shit in a minute. But Lord, it's feeling kind of crunchy. <laughs> I need some grease. Some good old grease. Some knuckle grease. Some, oh, I got the hiccups. Hiccup grease. Okay, hold on. Oh, 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 let's go. Go, go, go. Let's get it. Let's get it. Oh. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Hey, we all at? What's happening? We still live. Let's play a commercial. And I mean for the other place. Y'all gonna hear it, but the other place. They about to get a commercial so they can remember. Remember that this channel is supposed to be for adults. Literally, I don't know what's happening right now because I don't know who the hell I'm talking You gotta check her out. Huh? Huh? Hit her only fans up. She speak on top. Sweat on top. Oh, spicy. Hot sauce. Don't listen to them knockoffs. Don't waste your time. Let those only fans just stay in the jaw. No kids. I know what's wrong with their ass. They never talk. Gotta check it out. The cutie pie with the groovy vibes. Losing your time for some booze or wine. This seven land. She comfy usually. No booze to hide. One more again. Commercial. They're not gonna be quiet no more. I like this. You really You gotta check her out. Uh hit the only fans up. She speak on topics with a top off. Spicy, hot sauce. Don't listen to them knockoffs. Don't make your tell. That dose only cause she speak with you no kids. Cause so the only bitch you know. Check it out. The cutie pie with the groovy vibes. Losing your time for some booze or wine. Like that. 
they're not going to be quiet no more. I like this. You got to check her out. Uh, hit her only fans up. She speak on topics with a top on. Spicy, hot sauce. Don't listen to them knockoffs. Don't waste your time. That door's only because she speak with you. No kids. Because some of the homies, they should eat them all. You got to check it out. The cutie pie with the groovy vibes. Losing your time for some booze and wine. It's seven land. She come here usually no boobs to hide. It's only fans, no YouTube, so you can buy exclusive content. It's worth all your loot and time. Golly, with your girl in the other room, make sure you view it slosh. <laughs> or maybe she could watch with you. Oh, let's talk a little bit about some issues. Ah, uh, that's a good break of pause. Somebody just got that damn gun. I mean, they just got that damn gun. Only because that dumb ass was in my way with a pea shooter. came behind me and shoot and push me uh, whoever the bitch with the blonde ponytail is I don't like her bitch out of sake you doing stupid shit with the damn gas tank dummy let's just get up out of here slow and I know that's not my friend so because I do have a friend that acts like that Yeah. Mm -mm. <clears throat> yeah, we know KFC ain't in here nowhere shit. Yeah! Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it! Woo What? <laughs> Is anybody surprised? Okay. 
Somebody got more, four more kills than I did. What up, Ego? What's happening, 12th night? What up? It's Friday. Let's get it, get it, get it. Hey, let's get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh, wait, did you know your number? Go, go, Ego. Hey, hey, get it, get it. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Oh no, uh uh. Quick run. I'm done. It's over. I'm done. The couch caught me. It's a hell no, lady. You ain't going that way. Yes, I am. I'm going that way again. Wait, hold on. Let's go. Uh. I did it. I made it. Let's go. Really? Okay, well. I can't call her a person, but. You know, she's a personality. Here she goes. Princess Pepper, what's up? High five. High five. She, she ain't having it. Girl! Oh, shit, it is late. I was about to say, why you yawning and shit like an old lady? But we old ladies. What's up? High five. Alright. High five. Okay, so... I have got to fix things on the other channel real quick to share my screen. I mean, you know what? Fuck that. We done that already. We out. Only because nobody is commenting, nobody's watching, nobody ain't nobody there. So let's go enter that place and leave. Make sure before I go. Yeah, ain't nobody in there. Bye, y'all on OnlyFans. Shit. Bye, Pepper. All right, let's move things back to normal.
all in my face like that, girl. Are you running? You can't get away from me. Oh, she had a gun the whole damn time. It was a the whole damn time. It was a player. And I thought I was fighting with AI. Y'all seen that? Uh huh. She must be off the radar. That's okay. A lot. Y'all better get up off my ass, man. I'm trying to get a radio station here. Ass car. Get out of this shit now. Uh -uh. Okay. Woo. I'm on one what damn need, channel. Some wheels? I can bring them around. Let's dress. Let's go. It's on the way. No, wrong car. Let's just get in this shit. Way truck, I'm bigger than you on the inside. Shit.
Y'all gonna tell me? Y'all gonna tell me or what? Y'all gonna tell me or what? I got no popos yet. Hey, get it. Get it. Get it. Y'all wanna know it's crazy? I done drove all the way this way and I can't remember that whole name. So now I'm about to just orbital cannon any damn body and leave this lobby. I can't remember that bitch name, shit. Who the hell bombed me? Who the hell came and shot me? Act like they was a, a, a regular old AI and then killed me. Who the hell was that? Get that bitch. I can't remember her name. I really can't, though. No, for real this time. I, I know I said that before and then be like, you know, diabolical and shit. But no, I can't. I don't know. It's Friday. How the hell am I supposed to know? I've been drinking. I've been drinking. I try to keep it on this beat, but it ain't gonna work. Wait, hold on, 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 hold Gonna drink some more. I'm gonna tell you again in 10 minutes. I've been drinking. I've been drinking. <laughs> Cause I don't want you left. What? I'm supposed to want you. I know I laugh, but really, I'm serious. <laughs> okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> you about to see. I don't know if y'all see my eyes blinking, but I feel them. Uh-huh. <laughs> Everybody hide in. See? How long we been here, Lord? I'm hungry. Okay, I see y'all. My analytics look crazy today, but just I do see. Wait, I do see people in the shadows. Y'all been fluctuating now. Forty-eight viewer playback. Where y'all come from? What did I say? Oh, shower fresh. Probably them words. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I was sleepy and hungry, so I'm probably going to feed myself and go to sleep. Uh, yeah, we did everything we're supposed to do.
So tomorrow I'm going to work on that video that's in my head that I didn't want to tell you all about, but I'm going to keep it in my head. And that's it. Good night. Goodbye.